find the derivative f prime of the following functions in first we have quantity 2x minus 5 raised to 4 okay this is not simply x raised to 4 it's more than that so we we got a composition of two functions okay and 2x minus 5 is inside function that raised to 4 this raised to 4 is outer function so from the chain rule when we have outer function f and inner function u and we're going to take the derivative find the derivative of outer function leave inside function alone times derivative of inner function so in this case something raised to 4 raised to 4 means it's like x to the fourth that's the outer function and we know the derivative of x to the fourth using power rule when we have x to the fourth then that will be 4x 4, 4 minus 1 3 so to find the derivative here using chain rule derivative of outer function that quantity raised to 4 so using power rule 4 that quantity leave that alone raised to 4 minus 1 which is 3 and that inner function is 2x minus 5 times derivative of inner function derivative of 2x is just 2 minus derivative of 5 is 0 so 2 minus 0 which is 2 so the outer uh, derivative of inner function is 2 uh, you can simplify further 2 times 4 8 times 2x minus 5 raised to 3 final similarly we have something raised to 7 so 1 minus x square is inner function and that raised to something raised to 7 it's like x raised to 7 is the outer function using chain rule then we get the derivative something raised to 7 so using power rule 7 that something leave that alone raised to 7 minus 1 which is 6 that is 1 minus x square times derivative of inner function derivative of 1 minus x square derivative of 1 is 0 minus derivative of x square using the power rule 2x so 0 0 minus 2x minus 2x we can simplify uh, 2 7 times negative 2x negative 14x on the front 1 minus x square quantity raised to 6 final we can rewrite this function uh, square root means x square minus 5x plus 1 raised to 1 half again this is like the previous two questions something raised to 1 half this is inner function that raised to 1 half like x raised to n that's the outer function now the derivative is then using this power rule if we assume everything inside is x it looks like x raised to 1 half then using the power rule n which is 1 half leave the inside function alone n minus 1 half minus 1 negative 1 half times derivative of this inner function which is x square minus 5x plus 1 let's find the derivative we got three terms derivative of x square is 2x minus derivative of 5x is 5 plus derivative of 1 is 0 we got two terms so we need to put parentheses around and this is it you may leave here or if you want to simplify this negative exponent put that on the bottom 1 over then this negative exponent becomes positive exponent 2 is already on the bottom so 2x minus 5 that's on the top all over 2 and this raised to negative 1 half when we bring on the bottom it becomes positive 1 half and exponent positive 1 half means square root or you may leave here for math 132 okay the question says do not simplify no need to simplify then you may leave here x is square minus 5x plus 1 okay let's go down here now uh, it's a cube root so let's rewrite the function this is same as x square minus x plus 2 raised to cube root means one third 
now something raised to one third it's like x n so let's use the power rule i mean chain rule but this looks like inner and something raised to one third is outer if we assume everything as x x n using the power rule n that inner one third minus one n minus one third minus one that's negative two thirds and inside is x squared minus x plus two times derivative of this inner function derivative of x squared two x minus derivative of x is one plus derivative of two is zero you don't have to write and this is it you may leave here or if you want to simplify get rid of this negative exponent putting this factor on the bottom so one two x minus one so two x minus one on the top three and this raised to two thirds on the bottom now this becomes positive which is x squared minus x plus two final